one thing you have to like balance between, right, is making sure everything is perfect, but also making sure that you're not getting obsessed over making everything is perfect. Because there are so many times when I've like tried to perfect a specific animation where that I'm working on. And, you know, I show someone the, the thing before and the thing after, and they're just like, I don't, they look <laughs> Yeah. And it's just like so you like you have to remember not everyone is like a musician and not everyone is a like an animator and so the the changes that are really enriching to you sometimes you can afford to let those changes go if you're pressed for time and what i've noticed helps with that is actually like you guys have if you've been following my if anyone who's here is this has been following my instagram they'll notice that sometimes i don't even export my video and my stories i literally just like take a video with my phone and then upload the video with my phone and that actually seems to compress enough details and like it makes it mm. it kind of like forces me to look at it through non-animator eyes mm. in a way i don't oh, know why that's cool that, but like it's neat because I, I just feel like like i can let certain things go a lot easier that way like i go like okay well i'd prefer it if this was like this but i can i can live with it if it's mm. not 